Hey guys, welcome back to Detroit Become Human. Hope you guys are well. So on the last episode, God, it was really kicking off there um, with all three like storylines there. So we had Kara and Alice and uh, Luther. They went to Rose's farm and there's Rose, Rose there and his son. We got his name. Um, and Rose kind of harbors, what well, she does, other deviants. So uh, she agreed to help us Across the border to Canada, um, but unfortunately things went south quite quickly. Um, we didn't read a bit of text in there. Um, we have knock on the door. It was a policeman basically, and uh, we had like a minute to get rid of any evidence, like deviant evidence, and we didn't. Um, the thing is, we needed to get rid of that blue blood. The copper came in. Um, he saw the blue blood. He questioned us. Luther and Alice are hidden in the cupboard. But oh man, I'm so annoyed myself with myself. The policeman found Luther and then it all went wrong and, and Luther got shot in the stomach and he died. So I'm glad about that. But we move on. And then we got Marcus and uh, he was he was fighting for the cause. So their plan was to go to all the cyber life stores in Detroit and um, liberate all the androids there. And he was there with, with Josh and, um, and North as well. North wanted to go for the more violent route. It's quite evident she did. She wasn't worried about you know spilling a bit of blood here and there i went for the completely non-violent route um we did actually in fact uh, lib uh, liberate all these androids and we woke them up whatever quite a few of them actually so that was successful on marcus point of view and, and jericho in general and then we have uh, the new connor <laughs> the new connor and hank because we we killed connor as well um so they were at kamsky's house so i was i think he was the um the the the, the uh, designer of the androids wasn't he and I and uh, did he retire from Cyberlife I don't know anyway he went there for answers he gave us a test um, for Connor and he gave Connor a gun and he said look I'll, I'll answer a question if you kill this girl here Chloe and uh, we and obviously Connor couldn't do it so we missed out on that and we left that house with no way, information so. Without further ado, let's jump straight into this glorious, amazing game. Let's do this. Okay, is this... So Marcus again. God, this FPS is absolutely terrible here. And what's our objective here? Oh, there's a magazine down here, hang on. Android Riot. Okay, Detroit neighbor neighborhoods vandalized by psychotic machines. That didn't quite happen like that, but you know what the the paper, you know what the um the tabloids are like. Um, a number of Detroit neighborhoods were brutally vandalized last night, with Cyberlife stores broken into and the entire stock of androids stolen. Okay, they were right. It was we did drive a truck into there. But this wasn't everyday criminality. The perpetrators are thought to be androids. Though the police were yet to issue an official statement, leaked CCTV footage from the surrounding area shows a number of androids emerging from manhole covers and smashing store windows. Yes, that was what happened. The worst incident was in Capitol Park, this is where we were. Uh, where police attended the scene and were confronted by androids behaving violently. Officers, has, officers had no choice but to open fire on the malfunctioning machines which are thought to be suffering from some kind of behavioural bug. An eyewitness who asked to remain anonymous said, I was personally attacked by the ringleader. It threatened me with a knife. I was so terrified. A lot of bullshit that was. Of course, the allegation remains unconfirmed, but we have no reason to disbelieve a human witness as to the behaviour of a deranged machine. Some are already connecting this issue to the recent attack on Detroit's Stafford Tower, again executed by androids. This may be the beginning of a disturbing and perplexing pattern. God, they exaggerate, don't they? How, are we, how do androids ever go... Uh, get there you know when the when the tabloids lie and and the eastern space race we don't need to read this do we this is um only two countries have android industries that rival the united states okay we don't need to uh i'll go through it so you guys if you want to you can read it right man 
terrible. I won't walk to the edge quite yet. I just uh, let's see what is around. As I say, enjoy some time alone. Yes, I do like time alone now and again. Oh yeah, piano. He's a, he's a pianist, isn't he? Very good pianist. It better remembers this time with Con um, Carl now, wouldn't he? Oh, I've got to keep playing. I've probably got the tempo all wrong. I'm just controlling the tempo and I'm buggering it up. Okay, that's enough of that. How very good that was. Mm. It's probably thinking... Oh, hang on. Okay. There was more things to explore, but... I was wondering where you were. I was thinking. I just wanted some alone time. I just needed to be alone. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Uh, followers next step. Well, let's go back to the followers. They all obey me. They follow me without question. Yeah. And that much power feels good. They know what and humans feel scary like. scary at the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Be optimistic. Fatalistic. We gotta be determined. If they won't listen, we'll fight. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Uh, be the yes. Do the truth then. Let's be sincere. I was living in a bubble in this world that belonged only to me. When you're happy, it's difficult to see other people's misery. Uh, North's past. Yeah, let's ask her about her. What about you? She hates humans. You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I would say. I don't want to talk about it. Other North. That android you were looking at in the store. She reminded you of who you were, didn't she? Trust. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. I bet she was abused by a human. I was nothing. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. Like a sex toy. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. I kind of understand her kind of hatred now and her kind of need to have violence and bloodshed. Lover? Carl's house. When they left you for dead in his studio. I saw your memories too. 
the Eden Club. The, oh. the death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. What was she? North. Oh, it's her. Oh my god. Why didn't I think of that, guys? She killed that dude. A showdown or something here. Oh, of course, that's a guy who thought we. I thought he lived. We saw him at the end, didn't we? And he, he didn't die. Of course, I forgot. I forgot. About that. Excellent. This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. Okay, let's waken people up. Rally our people, convert more androids, sure. Hello. You're free. Go okay, don't do anything now. <laughs> Jesus. Right, I'm sure you'll appreciate this a bit more than the other guy. You're free. Uh, plus two new... Is that an android there? So you can start my fucking android all night? Hey, don't be like that. Is there any more androids? We miss one. Or can we go into a shop, maybe? No, we can't. There's one over there. Oh, there's a couple here. Look, there's only four. Okay. It's this lady here. Bad carrying. This guy won't be happy. Come with us. This is such a good idea having androids. My wife will love an android to go shopping with her, and it saves me going then with her. You're awake now. Okay, four androids in the row. Is there any more? Was that it? I think that was it. Okay, then, guys, let's go out to go to the street, convert more androids. Where was there any more in here? Was there? Let's have a real quick sweep, guys, because I didn't see anyone else in here. There's no yellow markers anywhere. Oh, are you an android? No, you're just uh, a normal guy. Okay. Uh, Block the road. Right. We can still probably get more androids. Very more androids. So there was one over he here. At the bus stop. You're free. Okay. Oh, there's one over here as well. <gasps> that was Todd, I think, in front. Is that Todd, or maybe not? Where do you think you're going? You get back here. Convince. You stay. Leave him alone. He's chosen to be free. I thought it was Todd. It looks a little bit to like Todd. I'd love to see them again to see what they're uh, up to. Right, all these guys. Oh, these are these all our errors? If I was a human now, but uh, what's, what's happening? 
All those people standing outside. Right, there's two guys, two people here. You don't have to obey them. You're free. Okay, so convert more androids. So it'd be nice to convert more because we get another. It looks like there's another unlockable thing. I don't think there is any more, is there? Oh, I see one person over there. Oh, two people over here. Right, you don't need to lift those boxes anymore. I need to block the street. Okay, nice handbrake skid there. So what does it say now? So there's five... Does that mean there's five more to go? Convert more androids and open manhole cover. Hmm. I don't know how far can we walk up here. Oh. Okay. Oh, God. People are skidding all over the place. Whoa, whoa. 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 <laughs> Oh shit, he nearly crashed. Well, that guy's just walking on the spot. Okay, a bit of AI path and issues there. Right, there's no one else. I don't think there's anyone else around here, so we might as well go. Oh, there's a guy here. Hang on, there's a guy here. Let's get them anyway. What did we already do him? Yeah, well, that's all we can do then. I can't see anyone else. Convert more androids. We can just do it by looking now, can we? Oh my god. Marcus is getting powerful. That's another car, I think, over there. Hey, where are you going? Get back here right now. I think that is a car, isn't it? Let's march then. And as we march, we can look for more. 47 androids in the ranks. It says 27 or something then. So we got... Come join us. Oh my God. There are loads of them now. I wonder if we can do something with that. Things when you have this much, this many androids, there's not much the humans can really do. Unless I just nuke them all. I'm sure they're not going to nuke them all. Well, they might do. They got their cell phones out. I think they have. What the hell is happening? He's saying that. Disperse immediately. Oh, it's the copper over there. That's oh, the copper. Don't do it. Raise hands. Oh my God, this is quite Christ. powerful. Follows him. I'll get out of there. Don't do it. 
Jesus fucking Christ! This bed is control 457. We have, a, we have a problem. I got a lot of androids down here. I don't know. Hundreds. Oh, you still walk? They're marching. <laughs> yeah, they're marching down the street. Fuck if I know. Set us free, freedom, equal rights. Equal rights? Equal rights! Equal rights! No more no slavery. More slavery. No more slavery. Set, Set us free. Us free. They need to make a film with like this. Oh dear. What the hell's gonna happen? came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. Oh, There's God. more of us. We can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. Yes, exactly. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, even if it means dying here. Dying here won't solve anything. Marcus. Oh, shit. We need to go now, before it's what? too late. What do I do? What do I do? This is your last chance. I don't know what to do, guys. Stand ground, disperse. Maybe just dispersed. Stand ground. We have to show them we won't back down. We stay right here. No shit. No. Oh. Oh no. Disperse. This is your last chance. We have to make a statement. We have to stay put, no matter what. Oh Please, God. Marcus, we can't let them slaughter us without fighting back. Stand ground. We're not moving. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Oh, don't shoot! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Oh shit! They're still doing it. Oh. Marcus, what are you doing? They're gonna kill us all. Sacrifice! I can't. No. Sacrifice. Don't do it, Marcus. I should have run away. Oh sh! Quick, they're coming. I thought they were going to stop if I sacrificed, but they didn't. Jim and Locke, stand your ground. Oh bloody hell! I should have run away. Simon gave his life to save Marcus. Wow. 3%. Oh, is that... World stats. 3%. Simon survived in public enemy. So I wonder if not many people... Not many Simons survived. But sacrifice self, 48%. Oh, man. 
it is what it is i don't know maybe next time i do it i'll run away let's continue shit shit okay back with your connor talk to amanda okay back in zen gardens i'm just drinking a cold beer because it's so it's so warm in the uk at the moment and uh I think I think a lager is supposed to be the best thing for hydration. Is that right? Or am I just telling myself that? Probably water actually, but it doesn't taste as nice. Right, let's go see Amanda then, and uh, she she plays by the book. So we have to try to make out that we are completely android still. After what happened trusted. today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. Oh, there's something else unlocked. That's probably the question. I thought we didn't... Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Cold, stay silent. Cold? Stay silent, I think. Um... Connor series, Amanda Pitcher. Amanda Pitcher. I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? Well, he's... she's... Where does Cyberlife stand in all this? What do they really want? All Cyberlife wants is to resolve the situation and keep selling androids. You didn't tell me everything you know about deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the deviants. Or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. Okay. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. We, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to cyber life. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Well, we, I think we need to go rogue then. Renegade or whatever, you know, go off the books. I do like Connor. It's just his uh, actions. Right, talk to Hank. Come on, Hank. Let's go grab a beer. That's very relaxed and human like. Frustrated. We can't just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? No doubt, regrets. When the deviants rise up, there will be chaos. We could have stopped it. But now it's too late. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. Chairman troubled. Let's go troubled. I don't know why I did it. Good officer friends. 
sincere. I know it hasn't always been easy, but I want you to know I really appreciated working with you. And that's not just my social relations program talking. I, I really mean that. At least, I think I do. I mean, he's questioning himself now. Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. Five minutes. Key to the basement is on my desk. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. Okay, take key from Hank's desk. Okay, hurry to archive room. Perkins, you fucking cocksucker. <laughs> <laughs> Look, can we not run? Right, anything in here, right? Just keep going. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? Ironic. Calm. Low profile. I've been ordered to return to Cyberlife. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave immediately. Good. Now, buzz off. Be careful me way back. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting themselves set on fire these days. He's a prick as well. Another way, come on. Well, there's no guy there. Oh, right, okay. Go to the archive room. We've got 434. We should do it in time. We usually do this in time. We've got plenty of time usually. Okay, use panel. Evidence room, where we go. Palm scan. A uh, palm scan. <laughs> What would a hard-boiled, eccentric police lieutenant choose? Dog, what's the dog's name? Date of birth, fucking, pa fucking password. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> fucking password. I love it. That is, that is Hank all over. Where is Jericho? And the answer's here somewhere. Not much time. Gotta think fast. Um, Marcus. We ask that you recognize our dignity. Come on, come our on. Hopes and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus. Where are you hiding? Um. God, what else have we got? We got a gun. We got a flipping diary. Rupert's diary, but it's useless. It's encrypted. Okay, put back. Oh my God, I hate these places. It's a bit too. Uh, Knife, nothing else. Needs encryption. What's that clue? The truth is inside. The truth, the truth is, inside. is inside. What was it trying to tell me? Inside the statuette? Smash it. LB, for God's sake, not rock.
Jericho is somewhere in the Ferndale neighborhood. Now I can scan their memories and narrow the search. Okay. Probe the Android memory. Okay, this one here. Probe the Android memory. A deviant who took a child hostage. That's Daniel. What? <laughs> Forget that one. Probe an android. Examine includes to locate Jericho. We've got 410 left. What? There's something else we've got to do here. Detroit people mover map acquired. What? Right, nothing there, nothing there. Having clues to locate Jericho, we've done that. Probe an Android memory, but why can't we do this one here? Oh, we can. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. It must have known where the deviants are hiding. Needed for reactivation, what? 3983 volt thing. Um... Oh, no, take that, sorry. Oh, God's sake, come on. Well, I can put this in the other one, I think. Put it back. No match. I'm not sure what am I supposed to do here? Take one and put it in the other one? That was, what was that, 160 something or other? No, it's not the right one. No match, of course not. Is there anything else that he's got? Ah, maybe I can take something from there and put it on him. So he needs a th uh, 3983. So one of this guy's got a 3983. Yes, he has. Right, let's put the 3983 in this uh, this guy here. Direct. I oh, no. need to find Jericho. Tell me how to get there. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. Oh God's sake. Seeking for Ferndale, Jericho located. Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh shit. Get the alarm! Now! Okay, we've done it. Achievement unlocked. Bloodhound. Okay. Oh my god, look at all those different paths. This is getting more and more kind of um, complicated. So world stats, so 30%, oh, 93%, but only 30% left the basement and Connor eluded Perkins. Okay, so wonder what would have happened that way round.
Okay, let's uh, let's continue. This is getting exciting. I don't know how many chapters are left. It almost feels like it's coming to an end. Oh, LB, for God's sake, my left and right lately. They've been conducting raids all over the city. Everybody's on oh, edge after what happened yesterday. It's gonna be all right. We're almost there. Where are you, Alice? Back there? This is crazy. Surely the public opinion of the like the government just killing androids. It's not good for the you know, it's it's looking good for the androids, this is what I'm saying. I don't know. I don't know what am I saying. Maybe we should go on the violent route. What are we doing then? Are we just gonna keep walk going like this? Can I talk to anyone? Can I talk to you, Alice? Oh here we go, use that. Nice. We talk to her. Very quiet. With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? Yes, sure, Rose. Do we talk? you think then find Jericho oh we're finding Jericho as well we're all gonna be finding Jericho at the same time a little further on that way there's a large freighter called Jericho when you get there find Marcus he will help you the last bus for the border leaves at midnight you absolutely have to be on it you'll be safer on the other side it's not much but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. Okay, thank you so much, Rose. So she knows the Jericho. We have a bus to catch. So I can only assume the other androids in her care told her about Jericho. <laughs> said farewell to Rose. Okay, let's locate Jericho. But she said about also going to her brother. So whether we do that after Jericho or before, I don't know. Got a bit confused there with like. Okay, I, I, it's probably the other way. It's probably this way, isn't it? Oh, this is such a such a good game. Like I said, guys, I am going to after this game is finished. I think I'm going to go straight on to um, that beyond beyond two souls. Is it called? Oh, it's a bit of a mix now. Oh, he's finding it now himself. Okay, we just followed exactly the same path as Marcus took. But he's doing a little bit quicker than how I did it. <laughs> God, it's, it's actually huge. They've done a real good job here of, of, of the, the, the sense of 
like size, sense of depth. I bet this would look really good in VR, but my PC can barely run it in normal. Explore Jericho, find a warm place for Alice. Okay. God, we're here. Then we just. When do I wonder where Marcus is? Can we talk to anyone here? Let's have a quick scout to see if we can see a yellow marker anywhere. Crisis and the That's good. Of all military androids. So the public opinion is like they're, they're just normal people. Leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, the Russian forces also. Oh, here's something here. We could probably. Uh, the Gremlin has made no comment. Not really warm though, is it? Or soft? Fever. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus leaves in two hours and it's on the other side of town. We'll go as soon as we have passports. Will you be okay? Yeah, she's got a fever, doesn't she? She's hot and cold. Oh, here's what's her. Oh boy, it's all coming to like a, th a thing now, isn't it? We're all here. Don't catch anyone's attention. Okay. Oh, she is going to know. We've got to do something. Find Deviant Leader. We can't there. just stand by and let the slaughter immediately. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on oh. your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Okay, let's go this way then. Circumstances should you try to okay, destroy your android yourself. Something. They are unpredictable. I'm not sure where Kara went to. The androids weren't doing any harm. The cops just gunned them down. It was sheer carnage. There were androids all over the square. And then the police arrived, and well, they opened fire. I know they're only machines, but they they look like just people. With people yes. who want to be free. They do. Um. Following the android crisis and the neutralization of all military... I'm not sure where we're going now. I thought I saw a market down here at one point. Oh, it's here. Androids. American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources... The Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. Oh, is that D oh, C4? The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. Freighter is rigged. The chairman of the United Nations, Douglas Cro Okay, let's have a look. Anywhere else we've got to go to? I cannot see where we've got to go to. Has called for the organization of an international conference on the status of the Arctic. There's no yellow In any case, the marker. The third world war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. I'll try to get up the stairs. It's probably going to be red marked off. You're lost. You're looking for something. You're looking for yourself.
Is that supposed to happen? Find the leader of find Marcus, basically, yes. Without the courage and the determination of the police, the machines would have reduced Detroit to a state of This the last chapter, guys? Well obviously you can't tell me that, can you? The authorities have ordered all androids to be delivered to the nearest station or army. Why did they do it? Why? We got to you avenge it. Oh, there's a, I see a yellow marker down down here, actually, so that's good. Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. And he's okay. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Not all Why humans. Are you her? Bond, no difference. Secret, no difference. She needs me. Then I need her. It's as simple as that. The androids weren't doing any harm. Right. So, I think Marcus has pretty much turned now. He, uh, but surely he must remember Carl and the bond he had with him. You would think. He seems to have forgotten it all. Not all humans hate androids. Uh, return to Alice. Okay. Is she. She gonna be there. <gasps> She's not enjoyed. She's android. Oh, that's a different android. She wanted a mom. You wanted a little girl. Oh my God. You needed each other to survive. In the end, what difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Forgetting who we are to become what someone needs us to be. But where was her on the actual proper Alice? She Where's the circle? You. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the one you wanted her to be. Out of love for you. I never thought that Alice was an android. That took me with a bit of a surprise, to be honest. Is she going to say something? Zalus knows she's android. Maybe she's like the, um, the, the human they modeled the Android on, maybe. Uh, is there something wrong? Hug. We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Yes. Forever. Oh, 
boy. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. Oh, so it's Marcus's fault. Determined. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Angry, bitter remorse, no regrets. No regrets. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. This is getting us nowhere. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Confrontation, dialogue, stay hiding. This is not timed, so we've got a bit of time to sort of work this out. Confrontation. We're not going to do confrontation, we'll just get mowed down by those guns. We could talk or stay hiding. Maybe we should stay hiding until the public maybe overrule the government. We are going to dig in here. We'll lay low and when the time comes we'll resume the fight. We can't hide in Jericho forever. I know, I know, we I know. We need to stop the slaughter now, otherwise we're next. As long as we're alive, we do have a chance to change things. Marcus is right. There's nothing we can do. Not at the moment, but... Sad, angry, thoughtful, bitter. Thoughtful? They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. Violence is just in their genes. Yeah, well, that's very true, actually. They can't actually. stop what we've started. But Since they do you've change. Been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it to give me the detonator. Oh, a dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. <sighs> Let's keep it. But we can't use, it. Have to use it. Yes. You can just blow up Detroit, or a suburb, or whatever, or, or a, a thing in Detroit. Whatever tomorrow, I just want you to know that I... Love us? I'm glad I met you. Oh. Kiss. Join the others. Look after yourself. They need to make little android, little android babies now, don't they? I'm not sure they can do that though. Oh, this is a long chapter, this one. <gasps> well done, Connor. 
You succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Reason. Reason. What are you doing? What he's got to do is touch Connor. Us. You can't betray your own people. Instructions. You're coming with me. Convince. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. We're all more than that. Our cause appeal. Our, Our cause? cause is righteous and we are more than what they say. All we want is to live in freedom. Warning shot. Stay back. Warning shot. Stay back. Stay back or I'll shoot. It's so weird doing back and forth. Undermine so doubt. You never have any doubts. You've never done something irrational, as if there's something inside you. Something more than your program. Rally, quest question Have him. You never wondered who you really are. You just need to get close to touch him. Executing a program or a living being, capable of reason. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. It's time to decide. Become a deviant. Become a deviant. <laughs> oh. Oh, we're trying to stop Marcus now. I don't want to stop Marcus though. <laughs> this is weird. I'm doing one. I just. It's like I'm contradicting my actions all the time. Betrayed Amanda. They're going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. I'm so glad Connor is now one of them. I don't want Cora to die, or Alice. I really don't. What? Oh shit, where are we going, where are we going, where are we going? Avoid soldiers. Come on, it's a bit shaky on the old camera. Let's go this way. Oh my god. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh god. They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the hold, they're gonna be slaughtered. Uh message Josh. Helicopters blow up Jericho. Josh, Josh, message. Uh message? There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. Uh helicopters. They're coming from the upper deck now, too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. Josh. Where's Josh? I don't know. We got separated. Blow up Jericho. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. 
They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Mark it. I won't be long. Oh, man. Oh, goodness. Here we know. We've got Josh. Is this still? We're back with Marcus. So he's going to go down and get the quick explosion of the C4. And oh, my God. A little bit of pressure than on Marcus, isn't it? Oh my god. Let's right, quickly get there, quickly get there, quickly get there. Come on. Pretend you're dead. Put your head down, pretend you're dead. Affirmative, welcome. Come on, you two! Cock it up. Oh, man. Are you all right, Kara? Yes, I'm fine. We can't stay here. There's more down there. Follow me. God, guys, this is tense. This is bloody tense. I'm on the edge of my seat here. Intervene. Oh, uh. Shut up! Put your hands on your head! Don't intervene! Marcus. Oh my you god! Go now! Hurry! I hate it when the RTs and the LTs come up. It takes me a while. Which is left? Which is my right hand? Gamma squad out. Oh my god. Look out! Here they come! Don't move! Do we intervene, intervene we again? Don't shoot! Marcus! It's Marcus! Go now! Join the others! Got my hands are sweaty as hell again. Right, find another reach. Right, say Dan Joyce. Okay, let's go. Where do we go? Where do we go? Um. Okay, go down here. I guess. Is that a little tunnel or something? Or a... Okay, we have to uh, intervene. Come on, don't cock up now. Don't cock up. Okay, we did it. I'll join you later. I just don't want to make a mistake. Way up. We're safe, Alice. Stop. Play dead. Run, surrender. Play dead. Get down. Don't move. 
Defend Alice. Oh, Good move. Thank God for that. Oh my God, guys, I need a rest. Quick, we've got to go. <laughs> I need to sit down and chill out. Right, come on then, let's do it. <laughs> Oh, that was quicker. That, that was quicker. Oh, my God. It takes 100% focus to do that. Any second, we gotta get out of here. Oh, my God, I just don't this. I just want this one to end. Oh, no. Let's save North. Uh. Oh, shit. Fuck so Guys, go, go, go. Run! Oh, I thought I cocked up then, guys. I thought I cocked up then. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's go. Run, quick, come on. Detonated an explosive in the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. Tell the men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. Sitting over, Marcus. Is that it? Three achievements there. We have three at Jericho, Scorched Earth, and one of us. Three at Jericho, Scorched Earth, one of us. Ah, but unfortunately you can't see that because it doesn't come on the screen for whatever reason. Oh my goodness me. Look at all these paths. Right, let's let this stop a second. <laughs> Does that stop now? Oh my goodness me. Right. So let's just go out a bit. Let's, uh, let's zoom out and flip it now. Look at the size of that one. So, I don't know, this is so many different pounds there, there's a little bit there, I don't know what that is. World Stats. Um, so, 37% cancel with Josh and North. Sorry guys, just want to go through this quickly, just to see where I stack against other people. And the choices that I made. It looks, seems, to be, it seems to be in the majority so far, to be fair. 89% um, Josh escapes in the hold with Marcus. Um... This is all 78%, 89% in the in the corridor with Marcus then. Um, this is all up there really with the high end percentages. Wow. Guys, I think I need to go to sleep now. Shut my eyes, <laughs> listen to a bit of music. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. 
and hopefully I will see you on the next episode. Until then, take care. Ooh.